If you've ever wondered why um, architects, engineers, home designers use 2x6 walls in between bathrooms or even for bathroom walls that are going to have plumbing um, running in them, uh, this should give you a pretty good idea why here. The black arrow is pointing to the 2x6 um, bottom plate. Just wanted to give you an idea where the 2x6 wall is and the white arrow is pointing to a toilet vent and clean out. Um, the toilet of course is in the same uh, bathroom as the bathtub on the opposite side of the wall but it did need a vent and a clean out. So um, the that would be about a three and a half inch fitting um, plus the clean out. Sometimes that doesn't even fit in a uh, two by four or a three and a half inch wall very good anyway. Um, because once you your pipe is about three and a half inches and then you add the fitting going over the pipe and you're already over your it'd be about four inches so you'd be sticking out of the wall so the drywaller would have a problem with that. Um, two by six walls work great when you have a lot of plumbing in them and I just wanted to provide you guys with an example of a wall that has a lot of plumbing in it um, and of course the more pipes you have running around and through around the other pipes and through the wall studs um, the wider the wall you're, of a wall you're going to need anyway. Um, design in a house, in a bathroom, um, if you're going to need a clean out for your toilet um, and, or, be, or you're going to be running a few pipes in there um, it wouldn't be a bad idea to put a 2x6 wall in there just to save yourself um, the potential of having some problems or pipes actually sticking out of the wall creating drywalling problems.